Welcome to Living Local. I'm Gail Kivistad, your guide, and we're out here at the Rincon Brewery in Ventura. Now, you've heard of the Shandy. In Australia, it's half lemonade, half beer, and they call it the Bicycle Rider in Germany. And then it's also famous as a michelada without the salt. Let's go meet the brewmasters and see how these waves of grain mixed with the orchards of lemons. Let's go meet Chaz Cloud. Here we are backstage at the Rincon. We wonder where Paula Beer comes from. Right here. That's a special tree. It's like a special Christmas tree. <laughs> oh, so tell us about this. This is so exciting. Yeah. It is, it's fun beer to make. Um, so we took our American wheat ale right. and uh, infused it with Paula lemons. Uh, okay, so you say infused. Does that mean you take the lemon juice? Does that mean you take an essence or a zest? I mean, how do you really infuse? We use the, uh, the peels and specifically just the skin. We didn't want to get any of the white pith. Um, so we kind of peeled them like potatoes. Uh, we then use the remaining, remaining lemons in our kitchen uh, for everything we use lemons for. Perfect, um, so it's a whole use of all the lemons. Yeah. And super sustainable. Yeah. Now, tell us about the actual lemon in it. Like, what part of the process do you put the lemon in? So we um, get a kind of a hot extraction, like a lemon tea, but we're using the wort, the unfermented beer, to extract the lemon oils. And then we chill it down, send it to the fermenter, and let it ferment, and we get Paula lemon wheat ale. And then how long does it take to ferment? It takes about five days to finish fermenting. Um, after that, we'll take three to four days to cool it down and chill it and get it to, the yeast to settle out. Uh, we'll then transfer it to one of our bright tanks, which are these dish bottom tanks where we uh, carbonate the beer and let it clarify a little more, and then we package it. And is this one of your favorites? Let's just see. This is one of my favorites. Yeah, it's really uh, refreshing. It's a great just kind of summer, warm weather beer. Um, working with the guys at Limonero, we really wanted to to feature this. Limonera lemons really make it special, they don't do. they? They do, yep. Yeah, we love them a lot. Uh, we actually counter pressure fill the bottles. So it's filled, uh, the bottle's under pressure and you relieve the pressure and the beer flows in. So we don't lose carbonation that way. It stays nice and, nice and bubbly. Uh, we take them out of the uh, filler, fills them, and then caps them. And then we will put them in, collect them in a tray. Once we get a case, we rinse it off. Uh, hit it with a little compressed air to dry off the remain, remaining uh, water, pack it in the cases, and we put it in the walk-in cooler ready to drink. And it's a collaboration with the Limonera Lemons, and it's delicious. You've got to try the Paula beer for yourself right here at Rincon Brewery.